I'm Mohammad Farhadini. Uh, I'm a co-founder of the UN Yan Cheetah Society and the vice president of the conservation of the Asiatic Cheetah Project, which both are devoted to save the last remains of the critically endangered Asiatic Cheetah in Iraq. Just before the World War II, it was estimated that some 500 cheetahs roam across the country, mainly in desert habitats. I mean, eastern half of the country and some portion, a small portion in western, near Iraq. So, but after the war, it was, there, are, there were lots of, you know, there were lots of 4WD vehicles in this country and armed people. They tried to kill the cheetahs, they prey, so the cheetah disappeared from most of its range until um, in 1950 when the cheetah was officially conserved by law in this country and also its prey so the cheetahs recovered in most of its areas in 1970 the cheetah was estimated to be some 200 to 300 but after some political actually events in this country the cheetahs were again disappeared from most of its range because because conservation efforts were weakened in some areas uh, but in, in that case, even sometimes it was estimated to be some 10, 15 animals for whole of the country. But at the moment, the animal is definitely more than 70. And we think that it's something between 70 to 100 animals. There are too many areas that we know that the cheetahs are there but we are not able to approve it because we, have, we, have, we don't have any evidence. But for these 14 areas, we have evidence. But our surveys are continued to confirm more habitats because the cheetahs, the cheetah habitats are not fragmented in Iran. So it's quite expectable to have cheetahs between confirmed habitats. So the cheetahs can be even more. Actually, the cheetahs are in desert habitats, but unlike the, the African cheetahs, they are not in flat plains. Uh, the, the cheetahs in Iran are in hilly terrains, in foothills, where the mountain meet the flat plains. So this is a good habitat for the wild goats, for the wild sheep, and also gazelles, which all together, they come to hilly terrains to graze, to drink water. So this is a good place for the cheetahs to catch their prey, with, which have the highest concentration in these parts, you know, of the habitat. According to our surveys, we have found that the Asiatic cheetahs are supposed to be smaller than the African cheetahs. And for example, the average weight of an Asiatic cheetah and adult animals is around 30 kilograms but it's some 40 kilograms for the African cheetahs and maybe it's because the size of the prey because the prey that which the cheetahs in Africa they prey on are larger significantly than Iran which is only wild sheep wild goat and gazelle so a smaller prey needs a smaller predator so maybe this is the main cause that the cheetahs here uh, have a smaller body size and also sometimes in winter they have a longer coat longer coat winter longer fur which is due to you know this is iran have a cold winter so they need to be warmer in uh, in winter but in summer they have a short fur uh, which is you know this is quite significantly a, a difference between the winter and summer coat which is obvious in iran For the genetic aspect of the cheetah's ecology, uh, honestly, so far, the only portion that have been investigated is, is there any significant difference genetically between the cheetahs here and Africa? And the question, and the answer is yes, there is. And it's going to be published soon by some, you know, world now uh, conservationists. But the other question, is there any abnormality of, or any difference between the cheetahs here in Iran if, if between different population or there is any genetic inbreeding depression which is, uh, has been reported for the cheetahs in the world? It has not investigated so far, but we plan to do it soon.
Uh, actually, um, 10 years ago, no one was optimistic that we can so save our cheetahs. And even some people thought that there's no any more cheetahs in Iran. But now after 10 years, we are now happy to tell that almost 70 to 100 cheetahs are living in Iran in 14 confirmed habitats. And these are the only habitats of the cheetahs in the world. Uh, actually, maybe 10 years ago, the population was estimated to be no more than 60, but now we have even we have more we have at least 70 to 100 and we are proud of it that we have been able to save this animal